I want you to have this job. Of course. Stu Zimmer's online, too. Great, thanks. I've got to take this call. Listen, I'm really glad that you came in. I want you to have this job. Of course. Yeah. That's it. What do you what? mean, that's it? He never finished the sentence. He got a call. That was the end of the interview. I still haven't heard about that job. Yeah, that's a tough one. What are you going to do about that? I have an idea. Yeah? I show up. Good morning. Morning. Good morning. Morning. Hi. Nice to see you. How are you? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How can I help you? Uh, the name's George Costanza. Uh, I'm starting work here today. I was wondering if you could uh, tell me where my office is. I wasn't aware that... Uh... Uh, Mike! This is George Costanza. He's starting here today. Welcome aboard. Thanks, Mike. Nice to be aboard. I didn't even know Mr. Tuttle was finished interviewing. Oh, well, he was probably just getting anxious to start his vacation. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to know where his office is. Oh, well, uh, all right, let's see. Uh, we've got two. There's the big one down the hall there and uh, the small one over here. You know, I should ask Jack. Oh, leave Jack alone. Jack's got enough problems. <laughs> I'll just uh, take the small office. Really? Yes, I, I like to feel cozy. And I have a very small apartment. I like to feel tucked in, nestled in. Love to be nestled. <laughs> all right, all right. It's 8.08 right down there. Meanwhile, I'll get you the Penske file. You can start working on that. Yes, yes, of course. The Penske file. Oh, can't wait to sink my teeth into that. Wow, that Penske. Well, we'll straighten him out. <laughs> So what do you do there all day? They gave me the Penske file. Yeah. So it's a nice place to work? You know, I'm enjoying it very much. I think my coworkers are really taking to me. We're like a family. Yeah. In fact, yesterday was Grace's birthday. She's such a sweet woman, so we had a little party with, you know, cake and champagne. Yeah. And I made a toast. And what, what about your boss, the guy who interviewed you? He'll be back on Monday. Mr. Penske? Of, of the Penske file? Mr. Stanza? Arthur Penske. Mr. Mr. Penske? <laughs> I, I, uh, I was just working on your file. <laughs> I was, uh, transferring the contents of the file into this, uh, flexible accordion-style folder to, uh... Where is Tuttle? He's on vacation. He was on vacation the last time I dropped by. Give me my file. Looks like you put a lot of work into this. Well, you know, in college, they used to call me the little bulldog. <laughs> there you are, Penske material. Would you ever consider coming to work directly for me? Really? You are aware. Uh, Mr. Costanza? Not now, Clarice. I thought Mr. Penske should know they're towing his car. Damn this city. I am aware. <laughs> Mr. Tuttle, you're back. George, I'm surprised to find you here. You are? God, I thought you would have taken the larger office. Oh. Oh, really? Uh -huh. I guess I didn't make that clear when I uh, hired you. So, where's that Penske file? Let's see what you've been up to all week. Well, here it is. What have you been doing all week? Well, you missed a lovely little party that we had for Grace. You haven't done anything with this. Well, bear in mind, I am in the smaller office. I'm beginning to wonder if you understand anything. You are aware that uh, Penske is interested in me. <sighs> You're not Penske material. <laughs> really? Well, we'll just see about that. Ta-ta. Uh, 
Tattel. 